I didn't want him to forget what he did to Christina. And, and I, you know, I did hope for a little bit of closure. That's Sandra Chesterman, mother of Christina Chesterman, who was killed by a DUI driver in 2013. Now, Riley Hoover, the man convicted in that killing, is heading back to prison on a new unrelated drug charge. Action News Now reporter Ryan Ketchum is live at Chico State, where Christina was a nursing student. So, Ryan, what was Hoover convicted of? Riley Hoover was sentenced this week to nine years in federal prison, Allen, and that's for dealing LSD and other drugs. This comes after spending seven years in prison for hitting and killing Christina Chesterman as she rode her bike on Nord Avenue in 2013. Prosecutors tell Action News now that Hoover was a drug dealer who was on probation in Ohio at the time of the crash. Sandra Chesterman was in the courtroom Tuesday for this new sentencing and says Hoover Hoover apologized to them, but she says it didn't feel genuine. I would have liked to have seen um, him write us a letter while he was in prison. You know, that would have made me feel like he was sorry. Um, but he had a lot of time to apologize. And in, in the nine years since Christina was killed, he never apologized. He never reached out once. And it would have still been that way had we not been in the courtroom on that day. The Chestermen say they've tried to continue on her legacy. They met the person who received Christina's organs and even fulfilled her dream by opening up a medical clinic in her name in Nigeria. And Sandra says she will keep an eye on Hoover during his time in federal prison. And she says he hopes he turns his life around and reaches out about Christina. Reporting live from Chico State, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Thanks, Ryan. And officials say they arrested Hoover as part of a federal drug trafficking investigation.